what is up gamers we are back again with another reaction today uh i'm excited because i didn't know this one was coming out i um hello johnson this is uh subaru cross check or what the f uh, okay i can i can read i stuttered a lot in the last uh reaction video too Hobo Johnson, Subaru, Crosstrek, XV, or 15, whatever you want to say. Uh, I love Hobo Johnson. Hobo Johnson puts out some bangers of uh, songs. He just released, well, the fall of Hobo Johnson's coming out, but I want to look at his channel real quick so we can see what the last track was, because I, Typical Story, that's what it was, Typical Story. I really like Typical Story. Uh, Ugly Kid was good, but I really, really like Typical Story. I think that was a really good song. I found out about Hobo Johnson, like a lot of people did, through his um, Tiny Desk NPR thing with uh, Peach Scone, and I've been banging his track since then, because he puts out great music, and he's um, he's not everybody's cup of tea, or he's not, yeah, he's not everyone's cup of tea, I guess is the saying I'm looking for, but uh, he, I'm into it, um, I really like his music, and I'm excited to check out this new track, because uh, like I said, Typical Story went really hard, and I really, really liked it. Um, I hope to see him in concert in Baltimore on November 6th um, because I really like him. All right. And I keep saying that a lot, but Hobo Johnson slaps. So, so let's do it. Let's uh, check it out. Okay. Ooh. I just bought a Subaru Crosstrek. I would have okay. bought a Lambo, but I'm not quite there yet. Sometimes Fair. I get drunk and I forget what day it is. I wish that I was right. skinnier, but I love sandwiches. One time I tried to burn stage to clear the vibe, then the smoke alarm went off. And my ex girl cried. She cried for a bunch of other reasons. I <laughs> I'm never going back to Four Seasons. I wish that I was friends with Drake so I can dig through his trash and have a yard sale day. Damn, I wish my name wasn't Frank. Fuck! I wish it was Blake. <laughs> I learned a lot from my dad, like how to yell a lot and make a car go fast. Okay. I wish that I was in the league. I'm a number one pick with two bad knees. <laughs> I just bought a super root cross track. Alright. I, like I just this. bought a super root cross track. We're both very reliable. Got a couple accidents. <laughs> I just bought a super root cross track. I would have bought a Lambo, but I'm not quite there yet. I just bought a super root cross track. I would have bought a Bentley, but I'm not quite there All right. yet. What's the point of being cool? Cut your hair and get a job like the rest I'm of us do. This. Don't play guitar in the park and just sit. If I hear another G chord, I'm breaking your shit. <laughs> Nothing like a Subaru Crosstrek. Suspension is soft as a cute little baby neck. My click orders club salads and look like they all sing ballads. <laughs> I could have bought a Lambo happily, but the insurance is high and I kind of want a family. <laughs> Why does dad have a Lambo? He was insecure about himself, son, let it go. <laughs> Nothing like fighting another man cause he cut me off in traffic and my morning started back. I'm glad that his kids got to see that his dad's a giant prick and that he got what he needs. Right. Nothing like crying in a Subaru Crosstrek. Life is an abyss half filled with sadness. My ex-girl's grandpa invented pinball. He had a lot of time on his hands. <laughs> Uh, I just bought a super oh, this is great. I would have bought a Lambo, but I'm not quite there yet. I just bought a super cross track. I would have bought a Bentley, but I'm not quite there yet. I just bought a super cross track. I would have bought a Lambo, but I'm not quite there yet. I just bought a super cross track. I would have bought a Bentley, but I'm not quite there yet. All right. Have you heard about the all-new Super Cross Truck with the new suspension package? If you buy one, you'll be riding smooth in no time. It also oh. came with a trailer hitch, but... I love this. It's only four-cylinder, so you probably shouldn't tow anything. My dad said that messes up the transmission. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, that was fun. I liked that. That was fun. Again, um, similar to, like, the day to remember, it's... it's uh, well, no, okay. That's I'm gonna stop making comparisons there because that wasn't the, what I was trying to say. It didn't make any sense. But this song was pretty fun. Like this was this was fun. This feels like something that he just kind of like he felt the beat and kind of just made uh, a track about a car, which is is pretty solid. And it's seems like a very uh, frank thing to do. Um, I don't know him personally, but I'm just gonna assume that because you know. That, that, that's how we do for celebrities because we're fucking dumb um but uh yeah no this is i this slaps i think this is be i think i like this one better than ugly kid definitely not better than than typical story i think typical story i really really like the instrumental and what he was doing with it it was really unexpected because i feel like he's a lot of like 
it, his first album was like a lot of like uh like almost sad boy type rap uh which kind of fits with my 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 uh my genres i guess um and then he just kind of went in on typical story and it was like a good mix between some like just heavy heavier rap with um with the sad boy lyrics and uh i really like that um like i said ugly kid was good it just i didn't really didn't seem to stand out to me as much as typical story did and then this one's just really fun this one's a fun track um it just seems like he enjoyed himself on it and i it, it really comes through i think um and uh shout out to subaru apparently um that's that's it's a pretty solid tr- song fucking track song tr- song uh it's a pretty uh pretty solid song there i'm really i'm into it i'm really into this uh i hope there's a couple more like typical story but i i feel like that's not something that's gonna happen um because i feel like he likes to at least uh, as indicated by his last tracks he likes to mix up what he does um and not really keep any of the tracks similar um in terms of like how the beat goes and just how how it all works out. I mean, lyrically, they, they usually follow like the more sad way, at least, uh, recently, this one's obviously kind of an exception to that. Um, but I'm liking, I'm, I'm liking, I like the direction of this track cause it was just fun. Um, but, um, uh, I don't, th- yeah, like I said, I don't think they'll do any more like typical story where I don't think they will be some heavy instrumentals like they'll do. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see because I know, I know the rise of Hobo Johnson was, I believe just him, um he might have had help but he didn't have the full band before the hobo chunks and the love makers was what they are now um so i don't know maybe we'll get some more like typical story because of that full band um dynamic um so it should be interesting um i can't wait to see him live and i can't wait for this album um i saw the mural he put up that was pretty sick uh that was, i'm i'm just excited i'm excited for this solid track um and i mean that's really all there is to it it was it was solid it was fun um so if you guys want to go and leave this video a like if you enjoyed it um if you want to leave a comment down below of some other tracks i should check out uh maybe even some hip-hop that is more like hobo johnson because i've kind of like not really super into hip-hop but i'm into like the sad boy shit i've uh checked out a little bit like scarlord i like uh his stuff is pretty cool i haven't like have any stuff saved but i've listened to a couple of tracks and i like him um for like that's more like a screamo trap type deal so I'm into that. If you guys have any note, any other artists besides like Scarlord that that do that and like X, I know uh, there was like this one guy who's, who's coming out recently. I cannot remember his name, um, but there's like a, there's a bunch of uh, bands like that, or sorry, groups like not even groups, just guys like that that are putting out beats uh, that are heavier with the sadder lyrics. Um, yeah. Anyway, any some like emo rap basically. If you guys want to send me some emo rap uh, my way, I'll definitely check it out. But this is. Um, this was fun. This was fun. I enjoyed it. Uh, like I said, make sure to subscribe. Uh, there should be a playlist up here somewhere with my reactions, uh, previous reactions. It's a lot of heavier stuff. So if you're a fan of Hobo Johnson, um, you might want to check out, check him out because you might uh, find some new music um, that's uh, a little bit different. But um, yeah, thanks for watching uh, and I'll talk to you guys later.